Hello everyone, today I will be discussing the APA Quantitative Research Paper. These are the parts of a research paper. As a general format, there shouldn't be any page breaks between the introduction, methods, results, or discussion sections of the paper. Pages that should be stand alone are the title, references, abstract, figures, and tables. The entire paper should be 12 point and double space with 1 inch margin. Next is the general rule in constructing the title page. The title of your work should not be any more than 12 words or less than 10. The title of your work, your name, and the name of your school centered on the page. Create a header on each page that includes a title of no more than 50 characters on the left-hand corner of your paper and the page number on the right. Now the abstract. The abstract should be no more than 120 words, which would be one paragraph with no indents and double space. You want to state the topic in one sentence and tell the reader an overview of what they will be reading about. The next part is the body of the research, whereby you would be able to find the introduction. For the introduction, start it by grabbing the reader's attention. You don't want them to fall asleep before they read the rest of your paper. Foreshadow what you will be talking about. Use references from different studies. Just touch the important things and don't go into great details. In a full thesis, this is in chapter 1, which includes the theoretical and conceptual framework with the research paradigm, statement of the problem, hypothesis, significance, scope and delimitation, and the definition of terms. The next part is the methods. Here, you will describe how you did the study. This should be written in a way that another person could duplicate the method that you used. There are usually a few sections in this part of your paper and these are the research design, research locale, participants, gathering procedures, instruments, and data analysis. Another important part of the research is the results and discussions or chapter 3. Since we are dealing with quantitative research, statistics should be included here. List the types of analysis or another test that were done to get your hypothesis. Tables and figures can be placed here. Don't explain all the results or interpret them. That is what the discussion section is for. As chapter of the study is the summary of findings, conclusions, and recommendations or chapter 4. You summarize the findings in chapter 3. Give the conclusion based on the findings, but this should not be a repetition of your findings. Then you give your recommendations. Lastly, we have here the references. The last section is the references. You want to make sure you put them in APA style and that you don't forget to include in text ones as well. So that's all for the parts of ABA research. Thank you so much for listening.